day two. Just an update on uh, Ryan's uh, piece of shit. It is an Xeddy. Hello. I, I can tell it was an Xeddy just by the color of the flywheel. The yeah. It's actually probably a Mitsubishi OEM. Might be. Might be worth checking the fucking numbers. Not really. It's so small. Want to show me your uh, your flywheel? Yeah. I guess so. Oh, that's special. Can I have it? No. Can I have it? Can I have your number? Seven. <clears throat> Plus, uh, I would rather we take it off because we have to put red Loctite on those. It might already be on there. I, I, I doubt it. <laughs> those, those those bolts back out though. Oh, sure. dude. Stop laughing. That's that's normal, dude. It's holding by two bolts. I'm just saying that part of the dust shield is still there. That's the top of the dust shield. That's what I'm saying. It probably went all the way around before, no? No, no it's a little plate. That's back. Okay, okay. It doesn't look that bad, so... You need me to hold the crank? No, I'm just going to the impact. I'm just going to get a socket for it. What are you doing? Just girl things. Just girl things? Yeah. Explain. Yeah. Frappuccino mocha something? I don't do frappuccino mocha something. No? Because I'm a girl. No. Oh. You wear Ugg boots? Who is this? Ugg boots. C'est quoi le meme là? T'as trop de plus de Kimber que des Uggs. Fat girl. Fat girl. The hairy boots? Yeah, sure. The the bear bear. Bear boots. Bear boots? No, I never got those. <laughs> I'm too poor. Day three. That's how it goes. What are you doing, bro? Gravel guarding an entire car. Holy fuck. Those, that, that leak though. No, the fucking tip is dripping. Well, you're supposed to have a towel. No, no, but the fucking tip is like... Maybe that's why it was 19 bucks. Yeah, maybe. I have one in the basement. You want to get it and try it? Mm. Mint. So, uh, we were going to paint the car, and then uh, a couple things happened. Uh, one of them being that the mixture in the gun was no good. I'm guessing because of that metallic gray. Just made like chunky, it looked like gravel guard, it was horrible. So, we wiped it off with uh, some paint thinner. And then once we figured out it was the paint, the problem, and not the gun, uh, we spent like maybe four or five minutes trying to clean up the gun. We noticed that the paint was crap. So anyways, and then we went to test the paint outside and it was too cold. And like all the panels were all like full of uh, moisture. So now Ryan's working on the, installing a Kia radio inside of his Mitsubishi. Like a pole. Like a pole. I don't know if it's going to fit good though. It's like a super 8 inch DVD navigation GPS from Kia. I guess it's from Kia. No. That's really it's weird that it's working. not. What? It's really weird that it's not. What's that? It's really weird that it's not from Why? Kia. No, no, it's from, it's like I have a receipt. What I mean is, it's weird that it's not from Kia. Why? Because like when you open it, it says Kia. Yeah, it's for, it's because it's made specific for a Kia. I don't know. So yeah, 
Okay, I got it. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's check this out. Is this fiberglass work? These are Ryan's nuts. Looks like shit, so I'll eventually just make a fiberglass like. Looks mint. Sure. No, it's not so bad. At least I love GPS and everything. If you can get it like to pop up a bit. I'd be able to, I just have to cut some stuff a little bit more. A little bit more. Yeah, I guess uh, still have GPS and shit. It's worth it. GPS, Bluetooth, everything. I traded a pair of mags that probably cost them 20 bucks. Like 60. Ryan's nuts. So, we took out the engine. Uh, I don't know if I got that on camera or not. But, uh, engine's out. And, uh... This is what happened, I guess. The slave master just blew up. He tried to weld it and then like, it blew up again. And then a uh, good thing we took out the engine because I was checking the timing marks. And let me just take this quick connect. Boom. I don't know if I slept. No, I don't have it. Anyways, the crank is out of time, like five degrees and then the balance shaft and the oil sprocket is not timed well and not timed good. So, I guess we're painting this tomorrow then. Zoom, focus. Zoom in on Ryan. Ryan Goslin there. What's that? I said Ryan Goslin. I thought you said I gotta put NOS in there. That's what I know. Some what? NOS. You know, when uh, Mr. Tran wants to shoot it up, he's got a NOS in there. NOS! Some NOS. NOS socks. Yeah, this is a pretty chill, like, uh... And then you can't show the camera your furry butt plug that's sitting on top of it. On the scene on your camera. Hashtag. <clears throat> wait, wait. I have a way it can happen. Look at this. Should be able to open. Oh, my phone's like pretty dead. Yeah, my camera's yep. pretty dead too. Is it's it still recording? Red. It's still recording. It's just the battery thing's flashing red. All right, so. See the furry butt plug up on there? Not really. Gotta go up a bit. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, this is my uh, Rhodes microphone. Can you like make it like at least? Yeah, I'll, I'll make it to, uh... there you go. Look at that. See the free butt plug up there? My new microphone that my girlfriend bought me last year. For my birthday. VTech. I'm gonna put VTech in my. Uh... VTech controller. Put some nice V tax. Talon. Sounds good. Overnight parts from China? That's actually Korean, but yeah. Why do you say that? Because it's a Kia radio. No, it's all China. That's what I said. It's off of eBay. It's a Chinese radio. Here, here's a receipt. China! The guy paid. How much did you pay for that piece of shit that doesn't fit? Seven hundred eighty-two dollars and twenty-six cents Canadian. Did he at least have a Kia? Yeah, like he had ran it in his car. I, I fired up the radio. It looks pretty good. It's from a Kia Optima or for a Kia Optima. Sorry. It's a two-din car dash DVD radio stereo GPS navigation Bluetooth for Kia Optima 2011 to 2013. So why was he trading for a pair of BMW mags? He didn't. It's another guy that wanted to pay $250 for the mags. Okay. So I got him to go pick those up and said, this up and said, I did, that's why I never seen the guy that I sold this to. But that I bought this off of, I mean. Wow. Yeah, that's why I got it. So you sold mags to a dude for 250, but that dude went to pick up that radio for you and you just gave him the mags for that. Yeah. Damn, Ryan. I, I worked this so I didn't even have to drive the auto to get the radio. Ryan, the Ryan's like the biggest Mr. Barter ever. 
Like I, I, I make people do what I want. <laughs> Ryan likes to go into the uh, into the the store and be like, "Yo, uh, I'd like to trade you two chickens for a uh, <laughs> for this this oil filter." Your price is way too high. You prices are way too high. I keep looking at myself on the screen. It's at least it's got GPS. It's a big thing. Kind of want to fire this up on Ryan. That's my face. That's still my face. It's still my face. That's Ryan. Now, which uh, which one of these is supposed to be the GPS? The one that says GPS. No, but it's because there's two card spots. Oh. Why isn't the card just still in there? Because you can. It's free updates for like. Damn, Daniel! Holy fucking complicated remote for it. Just, just so you guys know what we're what, what Ryan's doing there. For a radio. Is there enough buttons on that? Yeah, my China one had like that too. Well, like for something nobody ever uses, a fucking a remote. <laughs> it's for a just car like radio. I wanna, I wanna, yeah. I have less buttons on my Samsung TV. Right? It's possible. So, what do you guys want to know? You guys want to know stuff? Hey, big announcement! I just hit 3,000 subscribers. Really? Someone actually commented on uh, GS's LCDU uh, video prep. Okay. He wrote, "I'm subscriber number 3,001." So. Nice. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna go pop that up on. Is this still recording? Of course. Stalker. Up to eight minutes and twenty-six minutes. It's gonna, it's gonna be eight minutes and twenty-six minutes. Yeah, eight minutes and thirty seconds. It's gonna be its own video, I think. Ooh, who has who? Oh, damn, damn. Daniel. Let's see here. Videos, my videos, Northside Productions. LCDU, John Sebastian. I'm your 3001 subscriber. His name is Mart IJNVKK. I don't know if we're nice. gonna. Well, thank you for being a 3001 subscriber. I don't know if we're gonna get zoom on that. Come on. Maybe I can do it manual. I wish John's car didn't have an alarm on it right now. Why? Because I'd really like to just, uh, just, uh, hook this up to his car battery to test it out. Just put it in the, uh, the fuse yeah. outlet. Yeah. The wall outlet. There we go. So, yeah, thanks everybody for subscribing to my videos. We're definitely going to be getting more videos out. It's like recently I've started working on my cars again. <laughs> We're also gonna have another channel soon. I actually have a couple channels here. I don't know if you guys could see. Whoa, what happened to that? Wrong channel. Anyways, I have all these other channels. You can't see right now, but it's blurry. But we also have another one, it's game time. So go subscribe to that. Because we're gonna be uh, doing some uh, some gaming. Hey, I wonder if I could hook up uh, steering wheel controls on that car. The uh, in huh. and outer there. I don't know. That'd be pretty fucking cool. Be funny. Like a 97 Talon with Bluetooth and everything on the fucking steering wheel. You're gonna have to get a backup camera. I will have to get one because now I have the, everything else to do it, so. On a $500 car. Turbo V8 LS, six swap RX7 FD Dino Day. That's a really long fucking... How do you throw a sick car meet? Sick, bro. The burger challenge. The low in the dark skateboard. Oh yeah. The majestic K-series Porsche 911. I think I'm unsubscribed just for reading that because that's horrid. You should not put a case swap in a Porsche. Mind you, you also probably shouldn't put a 3S GE beams into an S14. But don't don't worry that's about. That's none it. of my business. 
Actually, the beams actually might be uh, saying goodbye soon, everybody. It might be. I have or to wait something else. I have to wait. Well, let's just say the beams wouldn't be going. Ish. When I... <laughs> 2018 Toyota Supra. What we know so far. Idiots of the internet. If you guys don't watch Joe Santagato, like, pause this video, go watch his, binge watch his videos. They are amazing. Or Monkey London. Who else? The guy who makes uh, the parts for uh, Haggard Garage. The parts. Well, or like all the machine shop stuff? No, like it's called Dan's Rods and Customs. Okay. He actually yeah. does like legit, like good work. Not haggard grow? Not, not haggard, no. He's actually pretty cool. He does mostly, he hangs out I think mostly with uh, Rutnik. Okay. Yeah, we were supposed to get together this summer and do a video with them, weren't we? Maybe. Well, I know we had talked about well, it. Well, yeah. Talked about it with them too, and they were down, but... We didn't go down to the states, so... Ryan's never been to the states. I've never been out of the fucking country. Comment in the video if you want if you want us to go to the states with Ryan for his first time. And where. The worst part is, we literally live one hour away from the border to the states. Yeah, I go there every week, dude. And I really, I'm really appreciating the My Lancer Evolution build part 16. Almost up to a thousand views in like one week. That's pretty good. Okay, so I'm really happy that it's- I also, uh, I looked at a bunch of like how to do fender flares and shit. Yeah. I think I might be doing my own fender flares. Really? Yeah, metal flares. Yeah. With an English wheel or? What? With an English wheel? An English wheel, no. Hey, let's go make this thing power up on the fucking Elantra. Open up the garage door. Let's not open up the garage door because it's like six outside. Probably is actually pretty close to six. Anyways, guys. Uh, Probably show them the fucking Kia radio working. Nah. Yeah, I really think that they need to see it start up. For the fact that it's going to be a tal in a talon and it looks hilarious when it starts up. So we'll pause the video. We'll come back to you guys in about uh, whenever we get this running. <laughs> That's gonna be in an Eagle Talon. <sighs> really wish the guy didn't fuck me over in that. Let's see if everything works. I don't know. No, okay, I have the card in the wrong slot. Apparently. This ends up being like fine. Uh, find address. We're gonna go to uh, ha. Oxbury. Let's go to uh, where I work. So. Tupper, where's T? <laughs> oh, there we go. Tupper Street. We're going to go to two nine one. Wow. Okay, yeah, that's kind of cool. Well, hey, it works. That's yeah. pretty fucking cool for a. Uh, Chinese piece of crap radio. Damn, Daniel. I don't know if, how you can zoom out. 
Pulling your leg back. Maybe not. Click 2D, maybe. Or you see 2D. That's fucking cool. <laughs> Let's go other side of the world. So we probably have a lot of viewers from actually right uh, from right about this is all upside down. I don't know if I can turn that around or not. Probably a lot of viewers from here. Australia. <laughs> Yeah, I know we're Australian dude. I'm just saying it's like fucking ass backwards, but Yeah, that's pretty uh not sure what that's telling me. Middle of the ocean. That's not us, so that <laughs> there's, there's a stranded body in the middle of the ocean. Telling us to go there. Sweet. I'm just pretty happy that this isn't uh, fully wasted. Now, what else can this thing do? Hey, yeah, apparently there's TV. Not sure how the fuck that would work. But anyways. USB. GPS. Radio, Bluetooth. Oh, it also has DVD and all that. SD card. All right, so that's not that bad. Except for the fact it says Kia when it starts up. It'd be great if it could, you know, not. <laughs> so if anyone in this, anyone in the world knows how to flash it so it doesn't say Kia, I would absolutely love you forever. I'd love it to be able to say anything besides Kia. Brian would love it. I'd love it. I'd love it a long time. All right. Also, this GPS magnet, this, uh, this GPS thing is magnetic. All right. That's it. Back into the garage because I'm cold. It's fucking three. But we're just gonna end off this video this Subaru and good night